Good morning after a very early morning. Made a pass security here at uh, Terminal 3 in Phoenix. Uh, if you watched some of my previous videos, I've been in here. It's the brand new terminal here uh, that they just recently built. And uh, Lindsay's with me this time, I'm not solo. And uh, we're going to Virginia to see my best friend Andy. Gonna do some flying and stuff and have about a week there. So we're gonna be recording a ton of videos for you guys there. And uh, are you ready to go? I'm ready to go. He's a muffin. So we're going to uh, Atlanta and then Atlanta to Charlottesville, Virginia, and then like a two hour drive. So uh, yeah, let's get, it, let's get it going. What are you gonna get? I'm looking for the muffins. Ooh, perfect. Looks like we found breakfast. And they have these cool kiosks where you can we can order. Sold out, are you kidding? No, we need coffee. So we couldn't pay with card, so we had to wait in line, pay with cash. Got our coffee. My breakfast sandwich. What'd you get? Did you get that? Strawberry and pecan. Did you get that oatmeal instead of the parfait? Yeah, I did. Surprisingly. Ooh. Born in our flight over there soon in about 20-ish minutes or less than that probably like 15 now so gonna quickly eat and then hop over there got our snacks all packed up ready to go let's head to Atlanta later made it to Atlanta uh, Lindsay's in the bathroom and I'm tired we both need to get some food um, but shout out to Delta I don't get to find them a whole lot because I live in Phoenix which is an American hub um, but they do such a good job with the free entertainment um, on the newer A321s uh, great entertainment system hundreds of movies uh, they charge you like two dollars for a headset if you don't have one but it's still a really good deal and uh, they do a drink service those are back on Delta as well uh, I think all US Airlines they might be since COVID but they do do a drink service which is awesome and the flight was super fast just because you get that tailwind heading east and uh, it's always nice to come to Atlanta because I don't get a chance to do so very often but we're gonna head down to uh, we're in Terminal B right now have to take the SkyTrain to Terminal D to catch our connection to Charlottesville and sometime in that we're gonna get some food and yeah it feels great to be traveling consistently again uh, after a year locked up so yeah let's go uh, catch the SkyTrain and go get some food. How's your movie? It was good. It was called Love and Monsters with Daniel Bryan, my favorite actor on the planet. It was really good. Nice. It's so busy here uh, compared, well, Phoenix was a little bit busy, but it was so early in the morning that you couldn't really tell. But uh, this whole concourse all the way down is super busy. Uh, we only have an hour, so let's start moving now. Let's go get some food. Lindsay was cold, so now she has a sweatshirt. <laughs> So if you watch the vlogs, you know that Lindsay collects her Starbucks, like the little mini Starbucks mugs from the different states that we go to and countries because we got some in Turkey. <clears throat> and after 30 minutes of going to three different terminals, we have failed. Every Starbucks didn't have any and some were closed, but we just stopped, got her a little souvenir thing and we're on our way to the gate to board to Charlottesville and we had a little bit of Mexican food. Sorry it didn't work out. Oh well. And see, this is what having a girlfriend does. They take your bag for you and you get to walk. No, I'm just kidding. I needed her to do that while I vlogged. So. Later, made it to Charlottesville, waiting on Andy, our drive to his house, and hopefully stop me for food. That food in Atlanta did not do anything for us. And Lindsay is currently looking for a camera part because I lost the little uh, 
thing that goes on top of the setting bug. It's a dial plate. A dial plate. So I lost the dial plate, so I have to order a new one. It's only like eight dollars. Um, but yeah, so we're waiting on him, and yeah, been a long day so far. But uh, I think we're looking forward to having a sit-down meal and getting out of the airport finally. And I keep, I always wear glasses when I travel to relax my eyes a little more. But I should know by now that the masks cause me, cause my glasses to fog up super bad. So I gotta be better about that, especially now. It's been over a year. But either way, waiting on him and food next. Terrible host. <laughs> he shows up 50 minutes late. <laughs>